Hey guys, this is Pretty Digi Designs. This is a tutorial on how to use one of my templates um, with Microsoft Word on your Mac computer. So once you download the template, go ahead and open Microsoft Word and find um, open wherever you put your um, template. Okay, mine is on the desktop. I'm going to put in a folder. So I'm open this Animones one. Click open. Okay. So it looks like this. So you shouldn't have any problems opening it. The only thing I really foresee happening is if um, this is this here text is larger, it's because um, you don't have those fonts downloaded. Um, normally, I um, have those attached to whatever program you download, but the Mac and Windows have different fonts, so you may just have to change the fonts. And here, this is where you change the fonts. This is a downloaded one that I have. And obviously you can change the size or however you want on here. And these boxes I have on here can be moved. I wouldn't move them because I have them kind of aligned when you fold the templates. And then here you can change if you wanted the title something different. Instead of in loving memory, you can put celebration. And if your if after you you put the picture and this is off, you can drag these side uh, bottom and side handles to make it wider or larger for this type of um, word wrap. Okay, so for pictures, I get a lot of questions on how to insert the pictures. So, so you're not familiar with the shapes in Word. This is how you do it. So you make sure you click on it, go to shape format, okay, see this shape fill, click on the arrow next to it, and click on picture. This here will um, put whatever picture you have. So I don't have any pictures on here, so wherever you put your pictures, just select it and click insert. But let's do an example. I'm gonna see if it lets me do no. Okay, but yeah, this is how you add a picture. You just go to click on the shape and shape fill and again arrow and select picture. Okay, it's fairly simple, and then you just kind of double click to change the words um, to edit the um, text and these templates. So that's really it. It's very simple. It's just a matter of just double clicking on these text because everything can be moved. And matter of fact, most of my templates have a white background. This particular one has um, a gray one because that's what I put in here, but you can also change it. So if you click on this design tab, you click on page color over here. You can change it from the gray to say you really like green. And that changes it to green. Or if you don't want any color, you can choose just white. And it will give it a cleaner look. But I find that some people like the colored background. So that's how you insert a colored background. So that is it. Let me know if you have any questions. You can email me at prettydigidesigns at gmail.com or combo me through Etsy.